Or that it will get baited, and you kind of already assume that you've lost the round, much less are ready to block a dust. So, coming all the way to grand finals. Uh, totally unbiased commentary totally over un here. Totally unbiased commentary. Totally unbiased commentary. Definitely not rooting for my boy. You got to you know. do what you got to You know what? I want to see a good game in Guilty Gear, but I also want to root for my boy. <laughs> Understandable. Of course, myself, Chicago, I don't have a horse in this race right now. Well, pick one. Or don't. I don't care. I'll root for SQ. Okay. Just so that way we can have a little bit of back and forth. Okay. 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 All right. All okay. right. So I'll be cheering for Sin over here. Um, I might get a little bit excited for Dayton, though. I'm not going to lie. All right, all, right, all, right, all right. I can't imagine as a jam player it feels good to root for Sin. I mean, it's really fun to combo Sin. That's fair. That's like, fair. I like, just, kind, I just, of, kind, kind of satisfying. I can kind of just like, do this on my controller, and it will probably work. Like, there you go. That, that's the matchup knowledge. So coming in, just discussing, both players looking very calm coming into this grand yeah. finals, actually. They have played this matchup a few times. Yes, absolutely. Oh, just talking about it, having a good time. Yep. Letting the, uh, gonna let the, in no, don't let the injuries play out. No, wow. we're going into the grand finals. Dane is on loser's side, so he does have, oh, we're going oh, to a uh, okay, button check. Okay, so. okay, okay. But anyway, since this is grand finals, Dane has to win two, three out of five sets in order. Yep. The first set will send SQ into the loser side of the bracket. We call that resetting the bracket. And at that point, if Dane wins again, Dane will have won the tournament. So he's got a much longer road to go. Whereas SQ just has to win a three out of five set. So it goes without saying that um, Dane being a top competitor at this tournament has some mental fortitude. He has talked to me in the past about how exhausting grand final sets from losers are. Absolutely. Absolutely. He plays a character where because you have to kind of keep the opponent out, um, you spend a lot of time just it's very taxing. Yeah, um, and you're at, and uh, the entire time your opponent is also learning your habits and is changing their own habits. While a lot of what Batman does plays around the opponent's as those are very very strong DP and very strong defensively baiting here from yeah, Batman. Wow, that was that was a really really good sequence. This continues to be a really really good sequence. Wow, Optimus stuff. Yeah, at this point SQ has all the meter in the world. She's going to dead angle out. Yeah, use some of it. Blitz, oh, but baits the blitz back with the low. Bait. Yeah, and that's an area whenever you get blitz in the air, sometimes it's best just to land and immediately throw. Now, SQ yep. was going for the uh, blitz back in the air, trying to take her turn back. Wanted to get that round um, back under control because she was definitely having issue there. Going to go for the task B. Not going to get a knockdown, but that, that new buff, that buff to the 6P, giving him that uh, anti-air, uh, the ability to combo off of it, means that tech scenario is much better in Bedman's favor now. Yep. So this is O gets the overhead and is going to be baiting the burst the entire time. Takes yeah. the safe burst point. Very smart from SQ. Ooh, wow. amazing air throw. I know Dane has been working on those air throws too, just trying to anti-air with the air throw instead of the 6B. Absolutely. So that, very, was a, that was a strong statement. Yeah, from, very uh, fast Dane first Dane. game. Yeah. Wow. So again, though, Dane does have to win. Has to win two more games. Yep. Resets in, the bracket. And then three games. And then win another three games before SQ can win three games in one set. Yep. So SQ can uh, SQ can kind of sandbag here a little bit and kind of learn what Dane wants to do and try to figure out what cannot what can Dane not deal with from Sin. So SQ she wow. might be she might be trying to sandbag a little bit. Ooh, good air throw reset yeah, though on that really tech. really smart sequence again from Drifter Dane. Just knowing what SQ is looking for here and uh, and capitalizing on it both through air to airs and through techs. All right, uh, goes for the. Uh, this is a dash in JP, but doesn't convert off of it. And SQ realizes that it's not his true boxing ability. Ooh, Ooh. Wow, what a wait. Yeah, holds that beat driver until, you know what, I can at least just uh, make you block it. Baited the burst, uh, didn't get it, and ended up dropping a combo for her troubles. Ooh, yeah, going to catch you with the DP frame trap. Again, because Sin can cancel into his DP into another special move, Sin can use that as a kind of frame trap. He can frame trap with his DP, which will obviously beat any button you press into it. That's going to be safe on block. Good jump out. Yeah. Uh, get out of that pressure scenario. Good awareness to just say, all right, all right, you want to go back to neutral? We'll go back to neutral. Um, so Dane with an opportunity here, but going to have to work pretty hard. I wonder if we'll see an early burst from SQ to try and just end this. Just try and uh, control the round? Yeah. I would not disagree with that. Oh, but that beat driver, though. And Dane trying to wake up and do something. Gets oh caught by God, the 2 Oh, that was all burst safe. Yeah, wow. and just going to go all just to that guts killing finisher. Yeah, of course you saw all those hits, a 16 hit combo just to finish that because that guts is so high. Yep. So Dane Ooh, now blocks that overhead with the burst, 
SQ also with a burst. Um, SQ looking a little bit low on resources now. Ooh, good 6P though. Sees the jump and just reacts to it. We're going to get the uh, Task A Prime. Teleports himself into the corner. Very good movement yeah, by SQ. Yeah, jumps out of the teleport cross up. Very smart stuff. Now that teleport is still on the screen with yeah, that Task A Prime. Deja yeah, vu. Can't, can't get Bedman off of you. Goes for the E. Ooh, goes for the E. For it. And it gets like a tiny amount of calories Yeah, not for even it. really yeah. enough calories for it. Very risky to go for those scenarios against Bedman. Gets the overhead into a reset. Oh, jeez. Uh, I do not want to see SQ bursting. Yeah, just dead angles out. Yeah, no dead angles. Just smart. Thought that Dane might have been looking for that. Looking for a super. And looking for a blitz or a super or throw. something. That's not going to be a combo. And that is round two to Drifter Dane. So Dan trying to uh, keep, keep uh, get another game on the board here yeah. and just try to uh, get the re bracket reset as fast as he can, not give SQ as much information. All right, uh, finds the safe. Oh, my gosh, throws right into the corner. Yeah, SQ with almost no meter now, so her jumping in the air like that right now be a big issue. She's got almost 25 bar here. Finds Destroys the seal very smart. Yeah, that was amazing. Ooh, going to punish the, the three H, though. Blocks the overhead, gets hit by another beat driver. Dash is out. Uh, this is another tough uh, calorie situation for SQ. And gets a uh, uh, sort of weak knockdown. Really into smart weak knockdown into just a setup. Empty jumps. That's wow. It. Oh, my god! Ooh, gosh, not a good burst. What an interesting way to make that burst safe. SQ shaking her head there, too. Just going to dead angle out. Goes Ooh, to the fuzzy. The overhead. Ooh, J5P wow. on the IAD. That They're amazing six, reactions. That was a 6 yeah. POS, right? Just did 6 It may have been, yeah. P. Yeah, I think so. Wow, so Drifter Dane up 2-0 in this first set. A very, very convincing statement. Yeah, and you see SQ, she she was adapting her play there. She was letting herself just get knocked down yep. and from those task Bs because you saw Dane still going for the uh, 6P, and obviously that was just OTG Sin at that point, so he couldn't get an easy tech. Right. So she did that a few times, and then right there at the end, went for the tech again, but Dane was still ready for it, still looking for the techs, and just air through. Yeah. So SQ's trying to make those adaptations, but Dane is just being adamant on I'm just going to keep doing this oh one thing gosh, and it's the, the early burst and Dave's just adamant I'm going to keep doing this one thing because in this scenario I don't need to make a risk based on you making a risk and here we have another situation where Dane does not have to take any risks yeah right? he's just doing a good job of blocking here his guard bar might be halfway there but th there it is SQ has to stop she has to eat and yep. that's what let Dane punishes it Good oh, press, though. I sort of question that Task C there. Task C was not over SQ at that point. Yeah, maybe Dane just wasn't quite sure what the seal was. Maybe it was just hoping that SQ. It's okay. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, safe jumps it. That jump H, safe jumps so many random things. I right. hate jumping heavy so much. It's Dane with full meter going to use that. Yeah, immediate JDRC. Yeah, SQ, I don't think just blocked any of those yet, which is fair because it's really hard. Wow, what it is a... very hard. Oh going to burn gosh. all that 100-meter combo wow. to get that kill. So much awareness from Drifter Dane to realize that that would kill. Yeah, that's very important to have that 100-meter and just use that 100-meter, get a combo off of your very hard-to-block mix-up, and then confirm the rest of the meter to get the kill. Very good combo. Yes. Wow. Okay. Task A uh, cross up there. We got some Marvel cross up. Is the uh, Task A Prime coming out? Immediately just mashes on it though. Gonna get down. some calories. Yeah. What's gonna happen? All right. Dane's just gonna. Dane's just gonna hold down back. Yeah. Just FD her out. Force her to come to him. Ooh, that's a big issue though. Yeah. He tried to jump forward and got caught while flying. Look at the damage from that starter. That was a lot of damage. Full bash. One of the huge damage on its own and not prorated at all. I don't believe. Good air throw yeah, out of that task. Amazing air throw into an amazing confirm. Now this is a commanding round from SQ. We're yeah, gonna see SQ the... really, really does want, doesn't want this game to go to uh, Drifter because if it does, the bracket is reset. Wow, that was an incredible sequence there from SQ. Just total awareness and control. Yeah, both players showing some amazing combos to finish out the rounds here. Ooh, good, good trade there. I think maybe one of them wanted for an air throw, but both take the trade easily there. Ooh, using that beat driver there to catch that air to air. Dane going in the air a little bit too much. Gets caught by the overhead, baiting the burst. Oh, gets hit by the overhead again, and SQ with a huge lead now. This yeah, is going to be a lot of work for Drifter Dane. SQ taking a lot of momentum here. Now, Dane has a burst, but this is not a time to use it. Ooh, tries to forward dash to uh, yeah, get through does, or whatever. doesn't get punished for it, but a dangerous situation. And that uh, Finally is, has whoa, to burst. Oh, my gosh. This, I mean... He had to burst, otherwise he'd be dead. So this is it. He just got a perfect him at this point, right? Yeah, and uh, a good start here. Good yeah, that's going to be a knockdown. Make it happen. Dane does have a hundred meter. He's going to go for some. Oh my mixer. gosh! What a smart jump out from SQ. But gets punished for not FDing. Now Dane has no meter anymore, so that's when SQ is going to go for the burst. 
Oh my god. There what are seals on the field. What a tense situation. Gets the trade. Oh my gosh. Ooh, that's not an air throw though, which I'm sure Dane wanted. Dane has to start up doing all these specials now. Oh, Ooh. can't find the 6P, and that is that is game three to SQ. SQ keeping herself in the winner's side here. Yep. Um, unfortunately, if Dane wins another game, the bracket's going to be reset. Goes so Dane's going to go to Paris, like, going to think himself out. Yeah, going to take a breath here. Hopefully uh, get something to drink, maybe kind of reset his mental process, because if he, can, he needs to win one more game as fast as he can, not give SQ any more information. Yeah, no more information. Doesn't want to tire himself out. Wants to win this as efficiently as he can. Okay, I have a question. What's going on with the rings on Sin's pants? Here, uh, once those close, just look. They're like, they're just like, oh, nev all right. Yeah, well, it's a belt mind. buckle. Yeah, no, no, no. There's, they're, uh, oh, there. the ones down here? Yeah, yeah, the ones down there. Yeah, what's going on with those? It looks cool. Okay. Okay, thank you. I mean, that's kind of Daisuke's whole, like. I mean, that's reasonable. It looks cool. Why does, why does Jam have an oolong tea can in her hair? I think that's a much bigger person. Amazing. Yeah, look, they're just flopping there. Those yeah, are going to hit your cool. thighs. It's going to be uncomfortable. It's weight training. Okay, okay, okay. You know what? That's fair. Anyway, so SQ, we can see SQ going for a lot more offensive offense here. And we, we I did see her do a lot more of the um, adaptation and going oh air to air. Gosh, did you see that? That was like a, an undernight rebeat combo there off the 6 uh, beat counter hit. Under night soon, Abbott. Don't worry. Hey, uh, listen. I like that game. Oh, blocks the super, but just jumps out. Yeah, Dane trying to take advantage of the plus frames for a cheeky 5D. All right. But SQ just jumps down, out. And that's going to be... Okay. This is a problem because that Taske Prime yeah, seal Taske on the... that Taske Prime keeps Bedman in the corner, even if he jumps out to make space. Now Ooh, good 6P there, though. All right, so SQ down on life, down on calories, uh, down on meter, too. Just recently got 50% here. Now, this is really important, so though, because she did get that 50%. That's going to be a nice amount of damage here. Does oh not block the over. It actually gosh. gets counter hit. Trying to do a wake up something. Going to have to block this uh, super and doesn't yeah, actually. Yeah, does not do so. Gets 50-50. Yeah, run up uh, overhead. taking the first round with a nice uh, sequence of, uh, of, of OP plays there. And both characters got their burst back coming into this round. SQ representing the beat driver very early, and there's the bull bash. Whoa, big counter hit into teleport. Okay, we're back to neutral, but Drifter is down on life and resources. Yeah, no, SQ has been uh, doing a lot more to control that immediate airspace with that bull bash, with that tiger knee uh, beak driver. And I think that's really working out for her because Dane's going into the air a little bit too much, although he kind of has to. Bedman, ooh, oh, bad whip. Big punish. Okay, and that's going to be into a reset. Yeah, ooh, tries drops to bait the though. burst, I think. Yeah, but doesn't get punished for that uh, wild 3H. Just going to block the beak driver. SQ with almost no calories. So even, even if SQ gets a knockdown here, she's just going to have to immediately eat and not going to get a good combo yeah, off no, it. So Dane is not afraid situation. right now. So uh, SQ basically does not have access to her specials right now. She can do one special. Yep. And it's a well, but it's immediately going to put her in uh, recovery. Yeah, but then she can cancel. That's eat. true. That's true. That's true. If you if you ever do a special even without calories, you can always cancel it into eat if it lands. Oh, I didn't know that. Yes. All right. Oh, J a rising JP to just stop. Okay. So uh, SQ with some early momentum here in the third round. Uh, yeah, just goes for the low. Doesn't go for the delayed overhead. Oh my gosh! Ooh. It almost picks up. But unfortunately, it hit OTG. That gave Dane the frames just to walk up and throw, and Eskew wasn't able to reposition. Mm -hmm. Okay, so uh, Beak Driver. Beak Driver RC just to get a little bit of damage on the field, get a little bit more corner carry. Dane's going to try to fly away here. He uh, gets doesn't the, find the 6P, just waits it out. There oh it is, gosh, though. Eskew getting those Tiger Knee Beak Drivers, knowing, where, knowing the ranges where Dane wants to be jumping up. Yeah, Made that there burst. It is. Gave it to her. And that's it, 2-2 two, two now. Eskew pushing Dane now to the limit. All right, 2-2. Two, two. Drifter Dane's going to make something happen to stay alive. This next match is going to, it, it's just going to determine the future of the tournament, of course. If SQ wins it, um, she's going to take home winner, um, win the whole thing. Dane takes it. We're going to see a bracket reset. Yep, and we are going to see possibly five more games to go to game. I wouldn't complain. I wouldn't complain. Dane going to take Dane's a little bit of time. Thinking both, about it. Both players taking a bit of time, getting something to drink. Bringing, bringing back khaki bed, man. Yep. Both players taking some deep breaths here, looking a little bit tired. Not that it was necessarily intentional, but I kind of like the, the implied language of, oh, you went back to character select? Well, I'm going to let you select your character first. Absolutely. I think that's always important. Um, whenever my opponent goes back to character select, I try to select my character as fast as possible. So. Oh, okay, okay, okay. That's your thing. 
Well, I select as fast as possible, so that way it's on them just to kind of oh, I see take as much time as they want. Yeah, for sure. Just be polite. All right, uh, just mashes. And uh, task A prime Ooh. here. Oh, yeah, very smart for SQ, just waiting there and looking for an opportunity. Yeah, I think Dane wanted to task B YRC there and didn't quite get it and just ended up in a really risky situation. Finds the anti-air into not quite a knockdown, tries to catch tech forward buttons, and instead just gets another knockdown. Yeah, SQ save burst, burst, though. Smart stuff. Save burst, but catches, just catches the task A twice there, controlling a lot of space. Takes the burst, I like it. Finds the 6P off the YRC. Bates the DP again. Uh, Drifter Dane maybe giving a little bit too much respect to that DP now. Yeah, unfortunately, Dane just walked away the entire screen and just gave SQ time to eat and get all those calories back. Yeah, that was uh, that was a, a tough series of decisions for Dane, and unfortunately, backing off may not have been the best one. Ooh, and that's another good beak driver. SQ's done a really great job of just catching those air-to-air -air beak drivers, and that's going to be tournament point now for SQ. If she can win this next round, that's it. She wins the tournament. That's it. That's the game. So Dane's got to win both these ma next rounds in order to stay in here and get the bracket reset. Could Ooh, good happen. 6P. All right, gets an early knockdown into, okay. There. Oh, wake-up DP. That's one of the first wake-up DPs we've seen from SQ this Boy, entire set. Boy, that was set. tough, too, because Dane definitely went for the safe jump, but just mistimed it slightly. Absolutely. Dane's doing a little bit better. No, he's going for, he's going in the air from much farther away and making SQ whiff those uh, beak drivers. Ooh, this is a bad situation for SQ. No calories. Yeah, very low calories. Any single special cancel she does, she's going to have to cancel and eat, so she needs the knockdown from it. Dane throwing, yeah, Dane just, yeah, Dane harassing her from full screen with that 3H with the task A just so that way she can't go for the E. Gets Finds the knockdown it. and mightily goes for the E. Yeah, can't get a big down amount of damage from it. Oh, catches, catches the, the back dash. dash. And that's going to be not a knockdown but a setup. Oh, but Tries you see there, the, you yeah. see there, Dane did go for the air throw again, but SQ's learned. I'll just take the knockdown. He's going to go for an air throw or 6P and it's not going to be Oki. Yeah, no, just take the knockdown, maneuver out. That's basically Guilty Gear's delayed wake up. Yeah, taking a knockdown feels so odd because, like, Oki is so strong in this game. But if you get hit OTG, you take effectively no damage, and you can tech immediately. Yep. Okay, uh, looking for just something. Dane trying very Six hard not to. through the wow. SK, yeah. Finds the, uh, finds the advancing jump S, though, and we are on the last round of this set, folks. Yeah, now, of course, SQ, she's coming into it with a burst. So that is very effective here. She could even use it early and probably get another burst back. Uh, Batman, not the most damaging character in the game. No, not at all. Ooh, gets hit by the task gate, probably Ooh, trying to jump out. Ooh, S to just catch uh, preemptively overheads. Could he use that beak driver to destroy that seal? Ooh, gets caught by the giant hitbox on the task E. Oh my gosh, this uh, DP putting in. You know, I just got done like a round ago saying that Dane was uh, respecting that too much, and it shows shows what I know because uh, SQ has made amazing work of that DP. She hasn't used the DP at all in the first few matches, and now she's using it plenty, which is definitely throwing Dane off. Well, Dane with a huge hill to climb. Not He's SQ going to have his burst back, I believe, but not a good... Oh, he actually uses it. He has to run it all the way back from here to stay in the server. But that wow. air throw. Wow, the awareness from SQ, and that is the tournament. SQ takes it 3-2. Yes, yeah, sees the Dane. YRC and goes for the air throw easy. Very, very good so match smart. from both players. Very impressive play from both players. So congratulations to our top three, uh, SQ, Drifter Dane, and White Beast. Yep. Um, amazing play.